So that's finished. So lift the presser foot, move the work out to the side. You've got some threads to snip, front and back. And that's your buttonhole. So it looks quite good. You can adjust the stitch density. I can see there on the left hand side looks slightly different to the right hand side. So I can play around with the stitch density and that is the knot and one here. So it might need to go closer or further away to get a, a better look, but it's certainly um, completely functional. Then to open it, the safest way to open it is to put a pin across here so that you have somewhere to stop. But uh, on a large buttonhole, it would be easier to do. So using the stitch ripper, pierce from front to back and then travel the whole way up, keeping away from the stitching and then stop well before the top. There you go. And there's the buttonhole.